Software development isn't what it used to be. We've cut development cycles from months to weeks or days, switched development methodologies from waterfall to agile, and replaced manual processes with automation. Continuous delivery is now the norm for companies that want to succeed. Software testing, however, has yet to catch up with the other improvements in the software development lifecycle. Of course, you want the user experience to be fast and error-free, but you don't have enough time or manpower to run all your tests every time a new feature is added. The testing process can't keep up with your development speed, so either you cut corners on testing and QA, or you slow down your development process. That's where continuous testing comes in. Continuous testing provides an automated end-to-end -end testing solution that integrates into your existing development process, eliminating errors and facilitating true continuity throughout the development lifecycle. So how does continuous testing work in practice? Continuous testing isn't just a process. It's a company-wide culture of test early, test often, test everywhere, automate it. It starts with the developers, who can now easily test the performance and functionality of their own code by creating and running tests using open source tools like JMeter and Selenium. Tests are stored and versioned together with software code using tools like GitHub. DevOps team can use the same testing scripts as part of the continuous integration process, using tools like Jenkins or TeamCity to test the performance and functionality on every build. Dedicated QA or QE teams then can use the same tests on pre-production simply by modifying some dynamic test parameters. In production, the operations team again uses the same scripts for acceptance tests and ongoing post-production monitoring, integrating with existing APM tools like New Relic for server-side application metrics. All this is done using the same code for on-premise and cloud-based testing by using vendors that support both, such as BlazeMeter for JMeter, performance, and API testing. For more information, download the continuous testing white paper.